A man accused in the death of a St. Johns County deputy last May has filed a federal civil rights lawsuit claiming that his rights were violated. I'm Tanika Hughes. I'm John Bachman. Lawyers for Virgilio Aguilar Mendez filed that lawsuit yesterday. It names Sergeant Michael Kudovich, the deputy who died after a six minute struggle with Aguilar Mendez. Action News Jack's Ben Ryan is live in the studio. Ben, you've been going through those documents for us tonight. And Tanika, the main focus of the 12 pages that we have right here is that attorneys are claiming that Sergeant Kunovich and another sergeant ignored their own policies and didn't give Aguilar Mendez a translator during this process, even though he repeatedly told them that he didn't understand English. No, no, Stop! No, no. Stop! No, no. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. A federal civil rights lawsuit has been filed for the suspect that St. John's County deputies say led to the death of one of their own. Stop! It comes months after St. John's County Sheriff's Office Sergeant Michael Kunovich died shortly after fighting on the ground with Virgilio Aguilar Mendez during an attempt to place him into custody. If at any time you are unable to hear the interpreters... Attorneys for Aguilar Mendez said he doesn't speak English and didn't commit a crime. His defense said that he was on the phone with his mother and didn't know why Kunovich was trying to search and arrest him, and he has since been ruled incompetent to stand trial because of a disability. The lawsuit against the county and two deputies says the sheriff's office discriminated against him because of the disability and that they denied him access to language translation services, saying they should have according to their own policy. What's your first name? Huh? Your first name? I'm sorry, I'm speaking, I'm speaking. Okay, do you have any weapons on you? The lawsuit also says after the arrest, the sheriff's office didn't give him an interpreter before an interrogation. Action News Jack's on safety expert Dale Carson weighed in on the documents. The value of the advisal of your constitutional rights is not authentic because if you don't speak the language, you can't be questioned anyway. And the advice of rights is only required when you're being interviewed about substantive matters related to the allegations against you. Now, I've also told you that a medical examiner ruled that Sergeant Kudovich died of natural causes and was dealing with respiratory issues. I also reached out to the sheriff's office and a spokesperson for the agency told me that they're getting with their legal team before making a comment. For local coverage, you can count on Ben Ryan, Action News Jacks.